Okay, so this is the part five of my computer course, and in this lesson you will learn uh, what is the hard drive. The hard drive is this, and uh, the inside is this, and uh, of course you cannot open it because uh, uh, the inside, the inside of the uh, the disk, there must be um, absolutely clean air because uh, the um, head, magnetic head. Is floating on the spinning disk at very high speed, and so a small particle can destroy it. So if you open a disk, you cannot open it. You cannot close it and let it work anymore. You have, if you want to, if there is a need to open a disk, you have to open in a white room. Okay, so let's uh, write what we know about the disk. So the disk is made of iron. And uh, the iron is not uh, really iron; is a ferromagnetic material. is magnetic, and uh, there are many sectors. Every sector can be magnetized or not, and uh, this sector can only be magnetized or not. So there are two states: so magnetized or not magnetized. That means. Uh, one or zero, true or false. So the minimum information that can be stored in a disk is a bit, can be zero or one. Zero one is not enough to to write something. So um, it is combined together. So eight bit equal a byte, and uh, one thousand twenty four bytes makes a kilobyte. And 1024 kilobytes make a megabyte. 1024 megabytes make a gigabyte. And 1024 gigabytes make a terabyte. Oh, so it happens that you just bought a 500 gigabytes disk, but your computer sees as a 465 gigabyte disk. Oh, what's wrong? I paid for six for five hundred, and I get four hundred sixty-five. Where are the missing gigabytes? Someone says uh, mm, that it is been lost by computer system. Uh, someone says is the recovery is not like that because the manufacturer cheated on the size. He just means five five hundred billion bytes. Because of course you can sell easily a disk that is 500 gigabytes, then another disk is 465. So the first one was uh, Seagate that in the 80s invented this system to make the uh, hard drive looks bigger, and the other follow it. So if you take 500 billions, you divide for 1024, and then again, and then again, you get. 465 gigabytes so you just bought a disk the disk is completely empty everything is not monetized so it's zero 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 and uh, here is the partitioning you can partition the hard drive in many disks so for example in this example there is um, the owner of this disk Dividing 15% for Windows, 10% for Linux, 25% for games, and 50% for data. But the most common configuration is that uh, around this. Uh, the biggest part is for data, and uh, the another part is for Windows. And then a common practice from computer manufacturers is that um, uh, they feel that uh, give you a Windows reinstallation disk maybe is too expensive because maybe it can be like uh, $2 and $2 on your new $1,000 computer maybe is not enough to, to make money so you just uh, save on the disk and uh, put a hidden recovery when you need to install the operating system again you can just press a key combination and delete everything I don't really like this approach. I strongly disagree. So, you just want to make a partition, and where the partition is saved, 
the disk save the partition somewhere in the disk. There is the MBR, master boot record, or GPT, globally unique identity partition table. And the MBR, of course, is older, so it means that every operating system can read it. And GPT is newer, and only newer operating system can read it. So if you have a choice, always choose MBR because it will give less troubles. Of course, if you want to have um, an hard drive that is bigger than two terabytes, you have to use uh, a newer operating system. So this is not you will not have a choice. And for example, many people come to me and um, and tell me, oh, read this uh, USB drive. I I mm, I made it with a PC format. When I put in my computer and I cannot read it because they choose the GPT format instead of MBR, so my computer cannot read it, even it is DOS formatted. So for today that's enough and check later for other lesson. Thank you for watching.